Hey, what's happening guys? This project is going to have to wait for probably Thursday because I'm having trouble with it. I've got everything working correctly except I can only get this motor to turn in one direction and I've tried uh, one, two, three, four other motors another controller card and out of the four motors and two controller cards I can only get one motor to turn in one direction so I got a couple more of these little steppers around somewhere but I don't feel like playing with it anymore today so what I wanted to talk about today whoops, was this little guy right here again let's uh, zoom in on it this is that PWM generator I bought from uh, eBay and it's made by Drock um, and it's SKU 2001709005 and it sells for three bucks and I thought yeah just something neat to play with but you know what after I started playing with this this is really nice like I said for three bucks it's an incredible deal so you can power it from three to thirty volts that alone is amazing. That, I mean, that means you can run it off of a couple AA batteries if that's all you had around. So you'll light this thing up. Now, the frequency range on it, which on, is on top, is from uh, 1 hertz to 150 kilohertz. What that's showing you there is 2 kilohertz. See the decimal point? And then if we run it up, that's down. Let's go up. You see it switched from out to set, telling us uh, what exactly is going on. Okay, so we should be at uh, 10 kilohertz, I think. I'm focusing on the, you know, being into the electronics for the super cheap here. So that's why we're bringing in the super cheap oscilloscope. I want to show you guys that you can do this stuff without putting a great deal of money in. So right here, you're looking at a total of what, about $38 worth of equipment. And 36 of it is this. Okay seconds per division and then we'll set our trigger level uh, I said we'll set our trigger level there we go and yeah we're getting 10.01 K and you can see we got 10 K here we can take it up to uh, 20 let's go 25 So there's 25 kilohertz and still a, a, a very nice signal I mean it's not bad at all all right let's run this up to uh, up to the top you know we will stop at 100 and take another look at the signal okay now if you look here you can see that our square wave signal has gotten a little less than square shall we say but still you get the idea so there we are at 150 kilohertz now let's take it all the way down I'm gonna run this down I'll be right back so we're looking around three kilohertz there take it down to under a kilohertz We'll just slow her right the hell down, right? Let's go. There's 550 hertz. And you can see at 550 hertz, we are getting a really nice signal. And again, we can adjust the duty cycle, which, whoopsies. The duty cycle, if you're unfamiliar, is the ratio of on to off. Let me grab a pointer here. So if you look here, 
this is the on this is the off okay so we're at 80 it's on for 86 percent of the time and off for the other what 14 and we take it down now it's not on at all only on two percent only on 10 percent so what we could do is we can put this on for like two percent of the time and it's I mean it, it is if we zoom in here it is still square waves but what we basically created is a uh, linear pulse generator take it back up to 50 percent and there you go so like I said for three bucks this is just such a nice neat little device and, and like I said you can do so much with it so what can you do with it right well an oscillator generates a waveform in this case it's it's a square waveform and they can be used for generating clock pulses for microcontrollers or any other type of digital device um, you can create a signal generator out of this um, put a low pass filter high pass filter you can change this from a square wave to a triangle wave to uh, almost a sine wave this isn't going to be quite fast enough at 150 kilohertz but you ramp it up fast enough and you can generate RF signals so that's pretty cool there too take a look at the circuitry going on here so here's the uh, circuitry basically other than the LED and the switches it's all on the back here and the first thing we have is this whole tech chip right here that's just your LCD controller then we have this Nuviton micro microprocessor here and this is what's generating our signal we got a voltage regulator diode uh, transistor basically some passives but here's what makes this neat look here ground TX and RX that my friends is a signal port Did I say signal port I did because sometimes I don't know what I'm saying it's a serial port a serial port and let's see here ba, ba, ba. okay the uh, parameters for it are 9600 BPS 8 data bits 1 stop bit no check bit no flow control and it's super simple to set the frequency uh, hold on Okay, so accessing the serial port 9600 BPS 8 and 1 holy crap you can't even see that can you had a little too much light going on there pardonnez-moi okay so if you want to set the PWM frequency you send it an F message for instance F 101 sets the frequency to 101 Hertz but if you set F 1.05 then you're going to get 1.05 kilohertz see how that works and if you were to set F uh, 10.5 then you would end up with 10.5 kilohertz pretty simple course you can't see anything I just wrote I am losing my mind now to change the duty cycle you're just going to send it a D message something like this so if you wanted to set the duty cycle at 50% you would send it D050 if you wanted to set it at 75% you would send D075 pretty neat and again for three bucks I love it I love it yeah what a neat little device and like I said I like it for three dollars yeah it's not worth twenty dollars or probably not even worth ten dollars but for three bucks you're getting a lot out of your uh, your dollars there all right that's it I'm done rambling hope you guys enjoyed this if you did give me a thumbs up feel free to comment and share don't forget to subscribe. Big thanks to all my patrons. And big thanks to each one of you right there in front of the TV or computer 
or your mobile phone watching this. Um, we're up over 28,000 subscribers in two years. Freaking amazing. All right, I'm out. Peace.